In Freebirds, two unlikely partners travel back in time in order to get turkey off the Thanksgiving menu for good and forever save turkey kind. Hi, I'm Woody Harrelson. And I'm Owen Wilson. Here is a scene from our new movie, Freebirds. And one more thing. Hang, hang on, on to your, your nuggets. nuggets. Only one special word will be spared from this terrible yet delicious fate. Hey, Daddy, it's this one. This is the one I want right here. That turkey's not big enough. <laughs> <laughs> this is your Barton turkey. Happy Thanksgiving, little fella. I have never seen a movie like this before. It revolves around a holiday tradition, and you guys are the main course. <laughs> That's good. Yeah. It's bon well appetit. <laughs> what drew you to the story and your characters? Our friends in Dallas started this animation company, and they had this idea that just seemed like kind of a funny concept of us playing these turkeys that are kind of mismatched um, in sort of a buddy comedy. Ah, what is that? I like the idea of working with Owen and Woody, and um, Jimmy Hayward, who's the director of Free Birds, is a director I worked with before on a film called Horton Hears a Who. Some magic in the air. Once I heard the cast, I was in. Don't worry, you're safe. I'm tired now. This is your new home! Pizza! Does it get any better than this? Hello, soldier. Did you guys get to record anything together, or were you by yourselves in the studio? Well, we did have a couple. We had one session in Toronto and one in Hawaii uh, where we did some stuff together. But for the most part, they felt that in order for us to be more productive in our sessions, it was better to keep them separated. Yeah, that's true. Us? No, they almost got you. We are not an us. We didn't record together at all. So I would kind of hear the stuff that they did and play off of it. And um, I had worked with Owen on a film and so knew him a little bit, but, and was a big fan of Woody's having not really known him. But uh, no, we never, I mean, we've seen each other in the hallway today. That's been about it. I brought you a gift and that gift is me. Did you find that it helped being by yourself or did it? Did you like it more when you guys got to be together? Well, it's more fun when you're together and stuff. Like doing these interviews, it's more fun when you got somebody to kind of play off of. Hint, hint. It made me sad. <laughs> That's Just, what you guys it made like. me sad being away from my old buddy. Whatever you do, do not make a sound. Ah! Shh. You've been recruited for a top secret mission. Ah! What are you talking about? We're going back in time to the first Thanksgiving to get turkeys off the menu. Who are you talking to? What goes through your mind as an actor when you are approached with, we want you to voice a turkey? Because obviously, when you voice a character, there the list is of, of possibilities is just endless. Well, I, at first I didn't know if they wanted me to do a turkey voice. <laughs> Which, what is a turkey voice? I don't know. You did it, Reggie. You saved us all. For me, it was, it's about time. Finally, they're seeing into, you know, your what inner turkey. Yeah, my yeah. inner turkey. Animated films are like, you can really make big choices and take big swings, and they can be really fun. And this film is definitely like all over the place. It's packed full of stuff. I said, can we make them a little jive? There's something, uh, maybe I, I can see myself playing a jive turkey. So, and the funny uh, thing is, like, he really, when he wakes up in the morning, he just, he goes around in, like, the living room, gobble, yeah. gobble. He doesn't say words, he just gobbles. Is that like, how you get into your character for the day? It. That's yeah, how yeah. we got cats <laughs> on this thing. Luckily, I've learned that, you know, there's a lot of discussion before you actually start recording, so you don't make that turkey choice. Wait! Ah! Take us to the first Thanksgiving. I love that Reggie's whole life and being kind of changes as soon as he meets Jenny. He mm -hmm. would do anything for her. Yeah. How would you describe that relationship? Well, it's kind of sweet. He just he just falls for her really quick and he's kind of enamored by how uh, together and self-possessed and poised she is. And it's fun because she's a very like strong character who really does, just doesn't wait for him to get things. She just kind of does her thing and he runs alongside of her. So, uh, and the film was a lot of her pulling him out of danger. Um, so it was a sweet to do that with Owen. I will get those birds. Every last one of them. Enemy approaching. You must follow me blindly. This movie comes right in time for the holidays and what is your favorite holiday movie? My favorite holiday movie is, uh, 
Jimmy What's one of Jimmy, yours? Jimmy Stewart. I really like Hocus Pocus for Halloween, but I like Christmas Story for Christmas. The yeah. Rider BB Gun, obviously. Yeah, yeah those are good ones. <laughs> yeah. I like the It's a Wonderful Life is my favorite holiday movie. And I know it's like everybody likes that movie, and they always show it around Christmas, but... Uh, I do love that movie. I love That's the why they theme it of it. Yeah. It's, a good it's one. Capra S. You see this line? Do not come into my personal space. Did you not see the line? Because I was pretty clear. Made in Hollywood.